Are you thinking about moving to Marietta, Georgia? Well, this is the video for you. In this video, we're gonna talk all things Marietta, Georgia. It is the largest city in Cobb County. And if you are considering moving or considering Marietta, this is a video you wanna check out. We're gonna talk all things popular location and places to hang out and take your family, uh, school districts, different places to hang out and talk all things Marietta, Georgia. So if this is something you're curious about, let's hop over to Google Maps and let's take a look around. All right, all right, everybody, let's get right into it. Taking my energy boost cup of coffee and let's dive right into it. So Marietta, Georgia, one of the ways that I love to start out is the distance from Marietta to Midtown. So Atlanta, the center of Atlanta, you have 25 minutes, a little bit of traffic maybe right now, but about 17.8 miles. Not bad at all to the airport. So Hartsville, Jackson International Airport. Folks, a lot of folks are transplant and they spend a lot of time at the airport. So 40 minutes. Now this definitely shows traffic, but take a look at the miles. 28.4 miles, not bad at all. Less than an hour, I dare say, on a good day, less than 45 minutes to get to the airport, depending on where you are. And one more popular place, one of my favorite places to hang out is the Battery, where the Braves play 10 miles away, 16 minutes, fantastic. So what we're going to cover today really quickly, guys, I'm going to share with you guys a few popular landmarks and a few places that you need to know in Marietta. And our major point of reference is this highway right here. Whoops. Cobb Parkway. This road right here runs all the way through Marietta as you continue to go this way. Here's 285. Let me get rid of this for you guys so I don't confuse you. This highway right here, Cobb Parkway, is pretty much one of the major turning points or major points of reference for Marietta where you can find a lot of your popular places to hang out. So I'll use that as my major point of reference because it runs parallel with 75 and here's a popular highway right here 285 you got the chattahoochee river right here as a few other popular landmarks you may be familiar with before i get into all that let me talk a few numbers really briefly um just in terms of the real estate so i want to share this with you guys right here and this is for your average residential detached home for four bedrooms or more the average cost of living in Marietta for the average single family home is 570,000 that's as of February of this year which is above the average for the MLS which is 440,000 so just to get an idea of the cost of living here in Marietta Georgia and now let's hop back over here to some of the popular places so right off of Cobb Park, where you have a lot of popular places. So the Battery is right here as well as Cumberland Mall, but these particular places, they have Atlanta in the address, so they're not technically Marietta. I believe um, the transition happens from Atlanta to Marietta right at this street right here, which is Marietta. I'm not quite sure, but this street right here, as soon as you pass over this, pass over this street, which is Windy Hill, and head north, you are, you are in Marietta. In addition to this, right off Windy Hill, you have a very popular golf course right here. One of my favorites to go driving, uh, practice your swing, is the Legacy Golf Links or Fox Creek Golf Course right here off Windy Hill Road. But check this out. You got Target. You got Golden Corral. If you are a cigar connoisseur, you have Wise Ash Cigar. And a lot of um, you have, a lot of your car dealerships are on Cobb Parkway, especially as you continue to go north. And the popular Big Chicken is also off Cobb Parkway as you continue further north. So another important thing to note about Marietta is it could be divided. I mean, Marietta is the largest city in Cobb County, and it can be divided primarily, or a common way it's divided in terms of reference is East Cobb is on this side of 75 and this is the other portion of Marietta as well. In East Cobb you'll typically find um, the real estate there is a little bit more expensive and the school districts there are also a little bit more expensive as well but it is still Marietta. So something to take a look at as well. So another popular place I want to share with you guys is right here which is Dobbins. Whoops. 
where's my handy dandy tool right here which is Dobbins Air Force Base right here off Cobb Parkway so this you find a lot of military personnel that train and live here on the campus one fun fact I learned is when the president I believe it was President Trump flew into Atlanta this is the this is the airport he flew into um, and I believe Biden as well but really cool fun fact um, Dobbins Air Force Base is a very popular military base right here in Marietta in addition to that, here's another place I want you guys to be familiar with is Life University. Um, not too far from KSU, but Life University is more your life sciences, chiropractor, things of that nature. Um, very, very popular university um, that you will hear referenced a lot in Marietta. But in addition to that, as we continue up Cobb Parkway, you'll see places like, check out Dave & Buster's here, Cracker Barrel, and um, a lot of just popular places to hang out as well. So another place I want to share with you guys is Marietta Square. This is, or let me see, let's go Glover Park, which is Marietta Square. So right here, you have your Marietta Square, Glover Park, very, very popular place. It's kind of like the downtown area. You have uh, your government buildings, Cobb County Superior Court, things of that nature. But one of my favorite places to hang out, especially for a Choctoberfest, is in Marietta Square. You got lots of your unique mom and pop shops here, Taqueria Tsunami. I love this place. Highly recommend it. Um, is here as well. You'll see a lot of your, your small businesses, mom and pop shops, different things of that nature. But once a year, Choctoberfest, or it could be more than once. I can't recall, but Choctoberfest happens at least once a year where a lot of really cool artists come out and paint the, the ground. They shut off the entire area. They block off the streets. And a lot of artists come out and paint the ground with different types of themes and murals. And it's extremely beautiful. I highly recommend it. I believe that happens in October. Um, every year in Marietta Square. So Glover Park is also a popular park where there's lots of concerts and festivals. You also have the train tracks that pass through here as well. You have Marietta Market, which is a very, very popular place. It's kind of like a food court vibe. And let's, let me show you guys real quick. Mary, Marietta Market, Marietta Square Market. So right here, right off Marietta Square, but inside of here, you'll, you'll you can see a really cool picture there, but lots of unique restaurants and pho and really, really cool place to take the family and hang out and walk. It's like the where you come and lots of folks are out there walking with your family and socializing. Really, really great place to build community. So where else do I wanna share with you guys? And keep in mind as a reference, Cobb Parkway is right here. Our major reference, boom, and then you come over here, boom, whoop, here is Marietta Square. So, very popular place as well. So, I want to share with you guys another popular place that's worth noting, which is Pope High School. So, I mentioned before that on the east side of Cobb Parkway, is unincorporated Marietta. It's still Marietta, but it is unincorporated. So you'll typically find um, the real estate here is more expensive and the school districts are ranked higher on this side. And Pope High School is a very popular school that I, I like to share with folks because it's very sought after. But as you can see, it is on this side of Marietta. So again, East Cobb is what it's referenced as, but most of the places that you will find here are still Marietta. As you can see here with Pope High School, it's still in Marietta. And last but not least, Indian Country Club. Oops, Indian Hills Country Club. Indian Hills Country Club, here we go. Very, very popular place because of, excuse me, so you can purchase a home in this area, very, very beautiful real estate. It's also a country club, obviously, as well as a beautiful golf course. But Indian Hills Country Club is just a popular landmark in East Cobb as well that um, I think you should know. And a few other references, just so I don't lose you in all of my illustrations here. Oops. So we have the Chattahoochee River that runs this way. Our major reference of Cobb Parkway right over here. 
And keep in mind we're on the east side and this is all still primarily Marietta and Indian Hills Country Club is right here. Lots of really, really cool trails as well. This being one of them, Soap Creek, Paper Mill Ruins. Check that out as well. So with that being said, I don't want to go into too much more detail, but I wanted to share with you guys some of the popular places that I think you should be aware of. And um, I thank you guys so much for watching and I will catch you guys in the next one. Take care. And there you have it, everyone. I hope this was valuable. I know it was short and sweet. I tried to keep it concise and share with you some of the most popular places that you would need to know about in Marietta. My name is Taj Walker. And of course, if you want to learn more, please feel free to reach out to me. If you are living in this area and you are looking to either buy or sell a home in this area, I'd love the opportunity to help and be a resource for you. All my contact information is in the description below and across the screen here. Reach out anytime. I'd love to speak with you more. With that being said, have a great one. Take care. See you next time.